And now, CBS 21 News First Warning Weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Russell. Yes, some sure signs of winter there with those poor firefighters trying to fight all that. Now we're under a winter weather advisory and this is for ice too, but this is for the more the messy kind as we start out your day tomorrow. So a wintry mix of snow, sleet and freezing rain as you wake up tomorrow morning. So the concern here is for icy conditions. So that's the winter weather advisory as we go through the day tomorrow. We still have some wind chills to contend with, but nothing like yesterday. Remember how nasty yesterday was with the winds? Winds weren't bad at all, but the wind's still still showing up in the uh, low teens here today. These are air temperatures now 22 in Lancaster, 22 Reading, 23 in Harrisburg. So even as, you, even as you look around the rest of the Commonwealth, teens in State College at 18 degrees, 18 in uh, Pittsburgh right now. And the big difference, winds are now out of the south. Not so much the strength of the wind, but the direction they're coming from. A southerly wind means a warm up for us, and that's the big story heading on into tomorrow. So here's our system coming from the west. The blue is some snowfall trying to sneak in here. Now things have been very dry, obviously very cold, so it's going to take a little while to moisten things up. So any chance for snow for us happens after midnight. So let's zoom you ahead to 11 o'clock tonight, and you're going to see this first wave of some snow. Remember, the blue is some light snow, and then a little bit of a break, but then another wave of snow here. So overnight tonight, while you're sleeping, we could see a little bit of light snow, maybe an inch or two. But this is the real story. See that purple color? This is 7 a.m., so between 5, 6, 7 o'clock, we're changing over that snow to a wintry mix sleet, freezing rain. This is when we could see some icing. So the big concern here is between 6 a.m. and 9 a.m. After that, we warm up to anything left over. That would just be plain rain. And honestly, it doesn't look like much in the way of precipitation. This next wave, this is Sunday. By then, we're well into the mid and even upper 40s. So just some rain showers as we go through the day Sunday. Yeah, it's not the greatest weekend uh, in the world, but uh, it's not going to be icy all weekend long. It does get colder as we head on into Monday morning. So here is your Saturday mess as we break it down. Snow overnight into early tomorrow again maybe an inch or two especially north of Harrisburg and then changing to a wintry mix between 6 a.m and 9 a.m. and that's what I'm concerned about ice plain rain by late morning by 10 11 o'clock it's changing over to plain rain so increasing clouds tonight no snow until after midnight tonight 22 for the overnight low but basically thing is that low now and we're going to see those temperatures creep up as we go through the overnight hours and here is your seven day forecast the worst part of our forecast is actually tomorrow morning. So that's when we start out with some ice. It changes over to rain and look how much warmer we are. 40s balmy in the 40s, 41 <laughs> tomorrow by Sunday. We're going to see some rain showers in 48 and then Monday starts out chilly back into the 20s to start out. But from there, not bad. 35 on Monday, 39 Tuesday, pretty quiet week. 45 on Wednesday, Thursday, 43 and uh, by this day next week, right around 40 degrees. So there's your seven day forecast. It's brought to you by members first. Federal Credit Union and check this out. Some people just haven't gotten the hint. It is cold outside. Oh my goodness. All right, this Montana man is shoveling, you guessed it, in shorts, shorts. and a t-shirt. Oh. He's also shoveling his driveway without gloves, I noticed. As well. <laughs> now I've done some shoveling to the point where you know you're sweating and you're you know you're putting right. out some exertion and you you do get hot. You do get hot, but, but not like not that. that hot. Yeah. I do have a friend that also always wears shorts, shorts. even in the winter time. Really? It baffles me. Put on some clothes, people. Teach their own, I guess. <laughs> I All right, thanks, Tom. You